Hey, my name is Jason. I'm a registered polysomnographic technologist and a registered sleep technologist. Uh, so I run sleep studies and I interpret the data from them. And uh, I just wanted to mention something. It's probably a worthless video, <laughs> so keep watching. Um, but uh, fibromyalgia and sleep. A lot of you know people disregard fibromyalgia as being a real disease, um, but you know you know they kind of have a a stigma as being complainers and, uh, you know, whatever. Uh, you probably see a lot of people in the medical community roll their eyes when they hear that. Um, mostly this afflicts women. I mean, practically always this afflicts women. And um, what it is is, you know, probably correct me if I'm wrong, but very achy all over the, like, the joints and muscles, like severe deep aches. and how this relates to sleep, which I think is very interesting, and it's one of the situations, what came first, the chicken or the egg? Um, their delta sleep, which delta is slow wave sleep, where you're supposed to be, uh, your body is thought to be repairing itself, and uh, growth hormone is being released, so you're, you know, your body's kind of doing its daily repair. Um, people with fibromyalgia, the waves, you know, I, let me back up. On my website, freesleepadvice.com, if you go to, uh, I have a link, it's near the bottom, it says fibromyalgia and sleep. I see, have a comparison of this, so you can actually see real sleep studies. Um, so the delta waves should be nice and big and slow in a normal person, but in fibromyalgia, you'll see these kind of big slow waves, but with real fast, they're like spindles and it's called Alpha Delta Sleep. And so and so it's like as if the delta is actually being disrupted. So is that what's causing the fibromyalgia? Or is them having fibromyalgia causing that sleep? I almost think it's fibromyalgia is more of a sleep disorder. Like it's their delta is, uh, their delta is off, and so that's causing them to have these deep pains or their muscles aren't regenerating. That's just me. I don't really know a thing about it, but uh, you know, definitely I think it's worth researching and finding out. Um, I'm not going to do that because it sounds like a lot of work and uh, I'm lazy. So I just wanted to mention that and give you something to look at and something to think about. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to contact me. YouTube is probably not the way. Um, freecpepadvice.com forward slash forum is the way to go. And you can join our little community.